Wildcard. Brought to you by Bob Mills Furniture. Here's the host of Wildcard, Ed Murray. And welcome to Wildcard, a game of chance and a game of knowledge. You're on just about everything to earn you thousands of dollars in great prizes. Joan is back as our returning champion, having won her last time out, $250 from Bob Mills Furniture. Joan is from Norman. Here to take her on, two guys. We got Thomas, farther from me, he is from Yukon. And in the middle, on the wide angle lens, is Rob. <laughs> he is from Oklahoma City. Welcome to the show, guys, and good luck. Good luck to you, Joan. The rules are simple. Correct answers earn points. Incorrect answers lose points. The point values increase in each round. And if you select a wild card, players, the point values for that question double. Wild cards are up there at random. So are jokers. They could show up, maybe not. When they do, they add points or they take points away. The final round includes one 400-point question and a decision to play or pass using that final wild card. Last time out, Joan had a big enough lead, held on to her wild card. She's in the champion's seat. Here we go. Five minutes, 14 questions, guys, whichever comes first. Joan, our defending champion, we ask you to get us started. Uh, Jack of Spades. Jack of Spades. Wild card right off the bat. We have a 200-point question. Math is the category. <laughs> if your dad is six feet tall, how many inches is he? Rob? 72. Yeah, and he would be looking up at you, wouldn't he? Yeah. 72 is right. Rob on the board first. 200 points. Pick a card. Eight of clubs. Eight of clubs is a wild card. <clears throat> Boy, I thought I had a nice deep voice till Rob opened his mouth. All right, television, the category for 200. Willie, Phil, Jace, Joan. Duck Dynasty. And size star in what A&E reality series, Duck Dynasty. 1972, they sold $8,000 worth of duck calls. Today, they're worth $500 million. Joan and Rob tied for the lead. Pick a card, Joan. Queen of Diamonds. Queen of Diamonds. Wild card. They're up there at random, and we're finding them. Thomas, it's your turn, everybody. In the news. Since its induction in 1924, what character has always been in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Rob. Snoopy. That's incorrect. Joan. Mickey Mouse. That's incorrect. Thomas, you want to take a shot or not? Uh, no. All right, the good thing is now everyone's tied for the lead at zero. Santa. Oh. Right, the first balloon didn't come along until three days later, and it was Felix the Cat, in case you ever get that. Yeah, Santa's always been there. Joan, you still control the board. Everybody tied for the lead. Pick a card. Ace of clubs. Ace of clubs. Sports. Duke, Florida State, Rob, ACC, Clemson, and Syracuse belong to what athletic conference? The ACC. Syracuse joining last year after 34 years in the Big East. Rob on the board as the leader. 100 points. Pick a card. Six of clubs. Six of clubs. Wild card. Hey, we're going to make up some time here. Whoever gets it writes the leader. Music. Which country artist did Taylor Swift sing about? And her first big hit, Joan. Tim McGraw. 2006 song titled Tim McGraw. It was more about his music than the man himself. Joan takes the lead by 100. Pick a card. Two of hearts. Two of hearts. Wild card. Oh, you guys are fighting. Again, they're up there at random. Could be every turn of the cards. Geography. What's the capital of Illinois? Rob. Springfield. One of his most famous residents, Abraham Lincoln, Springfield, Illinois, puts Rob in the lead. Back and forth we go. Pick a card, sir. Nine of hearts. Nine of hearts is business. What hotel chain is known for the slogan, we'll leave the light, Rob? Motel 6. We'll leave the light on for you, Motel 6. By the way, Tom Bodette ad-libbed that line. It wasn't oh, part wow. of the commercial. Now it's the part of the commercial. Rob, by 200, the leader. Pick a card. King of Diamonds. King of Diamonds. Instant winner. Our first one of the game. This is another merchant from Penn Square Mall joining us this week. You have $25 to spend at B.C. Clark Jewelers. So that is yours. No matter what happens in the game, everybody plays literature. What American poem's second verse begins on the shore, dimly seen through the midst of the deep? It ends just like the first verse, and the home of the brave. Rob. National Anthem. Yes, the Star Spangled Banner is wow. that poem, uh, the flag that inspired the poem at 15 <laughs> stars and 15 stripes. Wow. One of the few that had 15 stripes. Right, Rob. Eight of spades. Eight of spades, a.k.a. also known as 
What state has the nickname the Sunflower State? Joan. Kansas. Our northern neighbor, Kansas. That's the official state flower of the state of Kansas. Joan at 300. You're 200 out of the lead. Pick a card. Four diamonds. Four diamonds. Science. What is the common name for the epidermis? Joan. Skin. Yeah, the average adult has between six and eight pounds of skin. So you can just say, oh, my skin's just heavy today. Uh, Joan, you're uh, only 100 out of the lead. Pick a card. Jack of Diamonds. Jack of Diamonds is movies. Who plays Maverick? Thomas. Mel Gibson. That's incorrect. In the film, Rob. Uh, Tom Cruise. Top Gun. Yeah, Joan, you and Rob are buzzing oh, at the okay. same time, and his uh, locked you out there. Tom Cruise, because uh, we're looking for the film, but yeah, he did play Maverick er earlier. Uh, 86 film, one Oscar for Take My Breath Away, the song. Rob, you have control. Four of Hearts. Four of Hearts. Wild card, Ooh. another one. <laughs> Joan, you can tie Rob again if you get it right. Arts. The play, Children of a Lesser God, has both English and what other, Joan? American Sign Language. Special Language. I figured you might get that one. Sign Language. Marley Matlin won an Oscar in the 86 film role at 21, the youngest to win a Best Actress Oscar. Joan and Rob tied for the lead at 600. Thomas, you're on the yeah, south side so. of zero, but we got a long way to go, brother. We're going to double the points in the next round and get out of negative just like that. Stay with us here on Wildcard. Ingalls Shipbuilding is hiring electricians, structural welders, machinists, chip fitters, pipe fitters, and pipe welders in our Pascagoula, Mississippi site. Signing bonuses available for pipe welders only. Positions are union represented. Come build your career with Ingalls Shipbuilding. Go to www.huntingtoningles.com slash careers or call 888-888. 935-1507. Does being over 40 make you feel like half the man you used to be? Introducing Ageless Male, a life-changing supplement for men. Tested to help increase testosterone levels. You'll notice a boost in your energy levels. Workouts work. Sex life improves. It's like a light switch goes on. Why not increase your testosterone? Get Ageless Male now, risk-free. Call 1-800-729-1136. That's 1-800-729-1136. Get into something good, like Brahms Turtle Sunday. Get into something good. Two big dips of Brahms Premium Vanilla Ice Cream. Sweet hot caramel. Rich hot fudge. And then more hot caramel. Add roasted pecans, whipped cream, and a cherry. Now you've got something good. A double dip turtle sundae, only at your neighborhood Brahms. Get into something good. Experience shows us there's more than one way to get the job done. If you have a disability that makes it tough to get or keep a job, DRS can help. It could be new technology or doing things a different way. The solution could be easier than you think. Ask the Oklahoma Department of Rehabilitation Services about assistive technology. Go online at okdrs.gov or call 1-800-845-8476. On the next bones, a body is found cut in two. Severed spine equals foul play. No, not necessarily. Then it was an accident. No, it was foul play. I just said that. But the kicker is this. One victim with two sexes. A sex change operation. Now Booth and Bones must investigate their own relationship. Would you like me better if I was a woman? No, I'd be jealous that you might be prettier than I am. I would be, too. It'd be hot. Bones. Viewer discretion advised. Tonight at 7 on My Network TV. And welcome back to Wild Card. What a match we got underway. Our returning champ, Joan, at 600. But that's right where Rob is. 600. Thomas, right now at minus 100. We've seen it happen so many times before. Good second round. You can take the lead. Thomas, tell us a little bit more about you. I've uh, been married for 33 years, got uh, three kids, two which are in the Air Force. Outstanding. Thank you so much. Congratulations first on 33 years of marriage. That's always great, but thank you for your kids' service and your family service to our country. We appreciate it. Hope you continue to have a good time here on Wild Card. Rob, tell us about you. Married, four kids, worship leader at Integrity's Voice of Victory Church. Yeah, this is your new shirt out here. Do it big yes, for God. Yeah. God. All yes, right, and you, and you go by Big Rob, right? Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. Uh, good luck the rest of the way. Hope you're having a good time. Joan? 
Uh, a little more competition this time. It's tight yeah, here in the early scary. going. But yeah. you pulled away at the end last time. Maybe so again. Remind us a little bit about you. Uh, I live in Norman, teach at OU. I've got two grown daughters I'm very proud of and love my grandson, Elliot. Yeah, I called you out last time. You yeah. forgot the daughters. All right, yeah, we got them this time. Yeah. All right, uh, five minutes, 14 questions. Another round just like the first one, except we've doubled the points. Jokers could be two of them making an appearance. Thomas, you're in third right now, so we're going to ask you to get us started. Uh, let's go with the five of hearts. Five of hearts. We have history. This period of history succeeded the Bronze Age when people first learned to extract this ore to make weapons and tools. What is the Thomas? Iron Age. The Iron Age, yes, began around 1200 BC. Stone, bronze, then iron. Thomas at 100 on the plus side, sir. Pick a card. Uh, let's go the Three of Diamonds. Three of Diamonds. Instant winner. Good choice. That's <laughs> about you're going to be eating in Choctaw, Oklahoma, $35 to Old Germany Restaurant, and it's yeah. authentic Germany or food. So that is yours to enjoy no matter what happens. Everybody plays literature. In the novel, To Kill a Mockingbird, what was Atticus Finch's occupation? Jones. A lawyer. He was a lawyer. The 62 film, the only Oscar win for Gregory Peck playing that role. Joan takes the lead, 800 points. Pick a card. Ten of spades. Ten of spades is music. The origin of this song dates back to at least the Seven Years' War. Yankee Doodle went to town riding on a pony. Rob. Folklore. That's incorrect. I'll finish the question if you'd like. He stuck a feather in his hat and called it Joan. Macaroni. That's what he called it. By the way, it was a derogatory song sung by the British about the colonial soldiers. Yes, it was. We got the last laugh on that one. All right. All right, uh, go ahead, Joan, pick a card. Ten of hearts. Ten of hearts. Science. Breaks or fractures in this body part are normally confirmed by x-ray pictures. Thomas. What are bones? Yeah, breaking those bones, you get an x-ray and they find it out. Thomas, you're only at 100 now out of second. Pick a right. card. Uh, let's go with the eight of diamonds. Eight of diamonds. We have geography. In what European city would you find the Colosseum? Thomas. What is Rome? You're on a roll here now. It started building 72 A.D. right on the spot of Nero's palace. So they could wipe that off the face of the earth. Thomas takes over second place. You're 500 out of the lead. Uh, let's go with that six of diamonds. Six of diamonds. We have a joker. And it's a blue joker. He adds 200. Boy, that tightens things up. Joan 1,000, Thomas 700, ba uh, Rob 400, a.k.a. for 200 points. Charlie the Tuna is the mascot for what? Rob. Sunkist. I would say sorry, Rob, but no, you got it right. No, it's Starkist is right. You say Sarkis or Sunkist? I said Sunkist. You said Sunkist. Yes, so that's sir. incorrect, and then I spouted out the correct response. So we'll have to move on from that one. <laughs> it's fine. I was too worried about trying to say sorry, Charlie, which, uh, with, so now I guess I can say it. Sorry, Charlie, that was wrong. All right, uh, Thomas, pick another card for us. Uh, let's go with that Jack of Hearts. Jack of Hearts is in the news. He played Finn on Glee. And passed away the summer of 2013. Joan. Corey Monteith. At the age of 31. Died of a drug overdose. Joan at 1,200 points, a 500 point lead. Pick a card. Six of Hearts. Six of Hearts. It's television. Candace Glover was the most recent winner of what reality singing competition? Thomas. The Voice. That's incorrect. Robert Joan. Candace Glover. Rob. American Idol. 2013 winner, the 12th champion. You got it. It's the only one left. <laughs> you got those points back? Yeah. Process of elimination. Thank you, Thomas, for the assist. Rob, pick a card. Let's go Queen of Clubs. Queen of Clubs. Business. Sarah Blakely owns what brand of undergarments and shapewear? Joan. Spanx. Didn't expect the guys to ring in on that one. Intended to give women a slim and shapely appearance. She is the youngest self-made female billionaire. Wow. As the sole owner of that company. Joan, pick a card. Ace of Spades. Ace of Spades, Matt. Oh. Here we go. What is the average of the numbers 8, 12, 22? Average. 8, 12, 22. Rob. 11. That's incorrect. Thomas. 17. That's incorrect. Joan. Not going to pass. 8, 12 is 20, plus 22 is 42, divided by 3 is 14. Is that what we needed? All right, Joan, you still have control of the board. 
King of Clubs. King of Clubs. We had spanks, now we have sports. <laughs> what baseball term is used for someone who bats right or left-handed? The term, he bats right or left-handed. Switch hitter. Mickey Mantle, the most home runs by a switch hitter. 536. All right, Joan, uh, you still have control of the board. Three of spades. Three of spades is arts. The legend of which lost continent is told in Plato's Timaeus, Thomas. Atlantis. Yeah, dialogue written by Plato around 360 B.C. And that bell brings us to the end of round two. Joan, 1,400 points. Thomas, 500. Rob at 200. Everybody on the plus side. Everybody's still going. Everybody's We're going to bump good. up the point values even more. Could be a 900-point joker in the next round. Stay with us. Anybody can win it. Stay tuned. We'll be right back with more Wild Card after these messages. But in the meantime, play along at home by visiting our Facebook page. And if you think you've got what it takes to play Wild Card, just visit our website, fill out the registration form, and we'll notify you of upcoming open auditions. More in game excitement after the break. Nestled in the mountains of northwest Arkansas, minutes from Eureka Springs is Spider Creek Resort. Secluded on 50 acres, our cabins from studios to three bedrooms all have fully equipped kitchens and outdoor grills. Spider Creek is a home away from home for families, fishermen, and groups of all sizes. Enjoy hiking, float the crystal clear waters of the white or fish for trout. Our full service fly shop will address all your equipment, food, and beverage needs. Spider Creek Resort, your home in the mountains. Still wanting to quit smoking? Kick your ash with the vape bar. E-Cig kits start at $19.99 and come with a free e-liquid. Does your e-Cig need repair? The vape bar fixes simple repairs for free or repairs any vape for under $7. If it can't be fixed, use your repair cost towards any new product from the vape bar. Start kicking your ash today at the vape bar. The vape bar has two locations, an OKC at Northwest Expressway in MacArthur or at 12th and Eastern and more. Visit the vape bar on Facebook and kick your ash today. The vape bar. We get it. Your time equals money. And if you can't get to work, you can't get paid. Why would you want to stay all day at a dealership? We hear you loud and clear, Oklahoma. Now you can shop from work or home. Just visit us at thekeyonline.com and complete our easy online application. It usually takes about 15 minutes. Once you're approved, you can select your vehicle from our online inventory and we'll have it waiting for you. And don't worry about bad credit financing. We do that too. The Key. Cars. Loans. Life. If you're one of the millions of Americans who are disabled and unable to work, you may be entitled to disability benefits through Social Security. Receiving benefits is your right if you suffer from a physical or mental disability. Whether you're applying for the first time or you've already been denied, we can help. You'll be matched up with an advocate who will evaluate your situation, handle your application, and deal with Social Security for you. Best of all, there's no fee until you receive benefits. Call today. Today's KSBI Big TV winner is Jennifer Greer. Talk to Jennifer. Hi, is this Jennifer? Yes. Hi, it's Abby Broyles from KSBI in Oklahoma Live. You've won a 32-inch TV. Oh, my God. Yay. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. Congratulations. For your chance to win, go to KSBITV.com slash free TV to sign up. Then watch Oklahoma Live tomorrow at 4 p.m. to find out if you're our next winner. The rich and powerful take what they want, we take it back. We provide leverage. Wednesday on My KSBI. And welcome back to Wild Card. Joan, our returning champion, has the lead heading into round three, 1400. But Thomas and Rob, not that far behind. Thomas at 500, Rob at 200. We have a four minute round, 11 questions. Up the values of the questions even more, so lots can happen in the next four minutes. Rob, you're in third place. We're going to ask you to get us started. Queen of Hearts. Queen of Hearts is literature. Set at Trinity School, what Robert Cormier story primarily follows Jerry Renault as he challenges the school's cruel and ugly mob rule? The Chocolate War is the name of that work. First uh, young adult novel published in 1974. Rob, pick another. King of Spades. King of Spades is history. In 1846, the U.S. declared war on Mexico after it stationed troops north of this river, which is now the border between the two countries. Thomas. 
uh, what is the Trinity River? That's incorrect. Joan. The Rio Grande. The Rio Grande River is the one we needed. Joan at 1700, pick a card. Jack of Clubs. Jack of Clubs, AKA, also known as. What is the nickname for Stanford University? Joan. The Cardinal. Yes, you said it's singular. That's because it's the color cardinal. Uh, they used to be the Indians until 1972, then they were nothing in between. Uh, Joan, 2,000 points. Rob and Thomas both at 200. Pick a card, Joan. Ten of diamonds. Ten of diamonds is science. This odorless, unreactive gas's name is Greek for new. What gas produces a red light when ionized? You'll find these signs in bar and restaurant windows. Joan. Neon. Neon. Of rights. Lights of rights. Signs started appearing in 1855. Wow. Joan, 2300. Neon. New. Go ahead. Ten of clubs. <laughs> you didn't look like you were real confident with that answer, but <laughs> well, it was the right. Bars was my yeah. clue. <laughs> uh, miscellaneous. The bars was your clue, yeah. <laughs> you just admitted that on television, so good. All right. Miscellaneous. Miscellaneous. What Disney character's name is the shortened form of the Italian word for baby? Disney character, shortened Italian word for baby. The Italian word for baby is bambino. Bambi is that name, all right? Joan, it's easy when I have the answer in front of me. Go ahead. Ace of hearts. Ace of hearts. Joker, oh. That's the worst joker in the round, losing 600, and that tightens things up. I needed neon. All right, you, you can get 300 back right here in the news. On July 20th, 1969, Neil Armstrong made his famous quote when the U.S. did what? Joan. Landed on the moon. Landed or walked on the moon. We could accept either one. By the way, the one giant leap for mankind, he actually flubbed his line. He meant to say, a man, and he forgot the, he forgot the <laughs> A. Joan, 2,000, pick a card. Eight of hearts. Eight of hearts. We'll forgive him, though. He, yeah. he did a pretty good job. Yeah. Uh, television, who is the fairy tale equivalent of August Booth in the series Once Upon a Time? He has no strings to hold him up. Rob. Pinocchio. Yeah, played by actor Ian Bailey. Rob at 500 in the second place. Pick a card. Six of spades. Six of spades. Math. Here we go. 461 plus 293 equals 461293. 461293. Rob. Seven. 94. Incorrect. Thomas or Joan? A few more seconds to think about it. 754. Yeah, Rob, you're right there. All right, uh, you still have control of the board, though. Pick a card. Go ahead, Rob. Five of clubs. Five of clubs. <laughs> it's geography. Charleston is the capital of what city? Of state. Charleston, capital of what state? Joan. South Carolina. That's incorrect. Rob. West Virginia. West Virginia. West by God, Virginia. That's right. Charleston became the name of record 1818. Rob, you needed that one there. That was yeah. the uh, end of the round and uh, put you into second place. Everybody was is it within the margin of the wild cards. Jones, 1,700. Has a nice lead, though. Rob at 500. Thomas at 200. We're going to put wild card up on the board behind the letters of wild card or values. The blue ones are nice. The red ones are nasty. Uh, you can bust, lose everything. You can double your points. Thomas, Rob, you can add 2,500. That's the one you're looking for. All right. We're going to shuffle the deck. Joan has earned the right, as the leader, to select the first letter. A. She takes A. Rob, you're in second. What letter would you like? R. <laughs> R. Why not? R. <laughs> Thomas, what letter would you like? I'll try that L. The L. One 400-point question remaining. The category is arts. We will ask that question. Crowd our champion on wild card when we return. Watch Life Today, weekdays as James and Betty Robison provide real answers to real problems through compelling guests and miraculous testimonies. Witness God's love through inspiration, hope, and life. Join us in making a real difference in our world by changing countless lives and building stronger families. Don't miss Life Today with James and Betty Robison, weekdays on this station. I'm Dr. Angie, and as a doctor of chiropractic, people often ask me why I'd become associated with Bob Mills Sleep Spa, and the answer is easy, to help people. I have the privilege of using my knowledge of the human body and the exclusive technology of BedMatch 
to profile your back and find the right mattress for correct support. People suffering from lower back pain, hip pain, even acid reflux have reported noticeable relief. That's the reason I'm here. I'm Bob Mills. Now who's got your back? Want great green grass all year round with less mowing and practically no watering or fertilizing? Hi, Bob Vila here with a breakthrough in grass seed that can give you great green grass. It's called Grassology. Its roots extend four times deeper than ordinary grass to reach the good stuff that's underground, like water and nutrients. And the best part, Grassology reaches a dwarf height, so there's a lot less mowing. Guaranteed. We've all seen bare patches, bald spots, or brown spots caused by pets. Try Grassology. It naturally fights against disease, insects, even weeds, saving you time and money. Call or go online now and get one pound of Grassology for just $14.99. But if you call right now, you can double the order to two pounds. Plus, you can also get a 25-foot pocket hose ultra. Grassology for $14.99. Call now. You'll be glad you did. Call 1-800-503-0671. And today you can get a special Grassology double offer and a pocket hose ultra. So call 1-800-503-0671. Call now. I'm just trying to make it happen, you know. Every day, I get up, I go to work, and I work hard. I'm living, you know. Me and my girl, yeah, we've got a baby. And I love that baby. But sometimes it's just like another job. The baby cries, sometimes for a really long time. It's not easy. But you know, babies cry, and you gotta keep cool. Someone told me, make sure the baby's okay, you know, safe and sound in the crib, then step away for a few minutes if you have to. That's some of the best advice I ever got. And welcome back to Wildcard. Our returning champ, Joan, in good position, but Rob and Thomas are well within shooting distance with that final wild card and this 400-point question. You'll have 20 seconds to write down your response once I finish the question. Ready? Arts, the category. During his seven voyages, what fictional character was sold into slavery, met a cyclops, and got stuck on two desert islands? Good luck. During his seven voyages, what fictional character sold into slavery, met a cyclops, got stuck on two desert islands? A few other things happened to him from two. But those are the ones we want to know about. All right, pens down, please, everyone. All right, Thomas, you're in third place. We're going to reveal your response first. Who is that fictional character that had seven voyages? Sinbad. That is right. Hi, babe. Is that to Sinbad or is that some, That's, somebody else? Uh, okay. to my wife. All right, 600 points now. Rob at 500. You're in third right now looking for Sinbad. <laughs> You wrote Hercules. Hello, everybody. Everybody getting a shout out from Rob. You're still in it, though. You have that wild card. Awesome. By the way, the 1958 film was pretty good for its time. Yeah, it Sinbad, yeah. Joan, at 1700, do you have Sinbad? You do indeed. Also, a little shout out there to a lot of folks. So <laughs> consider yourself all. shouted out, too. I thought it might be my last chance. All right. Well, you're in good shape right now, but the wild card's still out there. Yeah. All right, Rob, you have the R. You're in third. You are 2,000 out of the lead. Do you want to hold or play your R? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm playing. Yeah, yeah I'm playing, took a lot of man. thought there, did it? <laughs> Thomas, <laughs> you have the L. You're 1,500 out of the lead. Do you want to play or pass? No guts, no glory. Got to play. Got to play. Joan, you have a 1,500 point lead, 2,000 point over Rob. Do you want to play or hold? Hold. The odds are with holding, but the 2,500, you've got to avoid that 2,500 card twice. All right. What is behind the R for Rob? Uh, Lose uh, a uh, thousand. Uh. You've avoided it, but the 2,500 is still out there. One card is bad for Joan or good for Thomas. The other five, the other way around. What is behind L? Oh. And 2,500. Oh. What, what was behind A? <laughs> Oh, and you don't would have doubled your points had you played it. Oh, but that's the way you do it. You play the chance of the end. And Thomas, you're our wild card champion. $250 from Bob Mills Furniture. Joan, you're leaving us a champion as well. Rob, hope you had a good time. We enjoyed having you. Thank you for joining us. Thank you to our sponsors. So long. Good night, everyone. All right. Wow. Wild Card is brought to you by Bob Mills Furniture and Platt College and Hal Smith Restaurants.